Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to move a YouTube video forward or backwards one frame at a time. It's a pretty cool thing. So let's go ahead and let this play. Kite surfing at Delray Beach. Kite boarding is... I'm going to turn off the sound. All right, if I press K, it starts moving. If I press K again, it stops. If I press the space bar, it starts moving. If I press the space bar again, it stops. Those are two ways that you can start or stop your video. Now the interesting thing is if you go to your comma on your keyboard and you click it once, it goes backwards. So if you want to go backwards, one frame at a time, you can do that. So check it out. I'm going to go ahead and pull it back. One frame at a time. Here's me just getting worked. And this is really handy if you want to uh, try to find a good thumbnail that you can do a screenshot with. I'm going to pull it back a little bit farther. See, right here. Now let's go ahead and see what happens here. This is me crashing. So if you wanted to get this thumbnail here, you could do a screenshot of it. Now if you want to go forward, you press your uh, period on your keyboard. And it just goes one frame at a time. Bam, 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 bam. One frame at a time. All right, now if you want to make it full screen, you hit F. Bam, there you go. Now we can go one frame at a time until we find something that we want to look at. If you want to go 10, uh, 10 seconds, you hit J. Now we went back 10 seconds. If we want to move forward 10 seconds, we hit L. And that's it. That's how you do it. You want to go backwards? Hit J. I'm going to hit K to stop it because it was moving. So J brings it back 10 seconds. And then you can find a, uh, a cool uh, shot that you might want to do a screenshot or make a thumbnail on. So we've got the quality at 180. So that's where you want to have it if you want to do a screenshot. Now if I wanted to do a screenshot, what I could do is I go Shift, Command, 4, and it makes this little target right here. You see it? And then I go over to the corner and I just kind of pull it across to wherever I want it. And then I let go of my mouse because I'm depressing the mouse and holding it. Notice how it shades that area. That's your screenshot area. And down at the corner there is your little, um, your little uh, target. And when I let go of that, it's going to make a noise. And that means I just took a picture. <laughs> so if I want to make this go, just play from where it's at, I press K. If I want to stop it, I press K again. Or I could press the space bar and then press the space bar again. And that's it. That's how you do it. Bam! Crash Ola. <laughs> All right. Those are some cool keyboard shortcuts that you can use to... Uh, oh, if you want to get out of this big screen, you just hit Escape. It goes back to the mini player. Those are some cool shortcuts uh, that you can use on your keyboard when you're in YouTube. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos on YouTube, on Final Cut Pro, on Mac, Apple, iPhone, and just about anything else. I fix toilets. I fix, you know, if I've never done it, I'll just do it and try to figure it out and you guys can watch. All right. Thanks a lot. Bye.